Hi, I'm Dr. Charles Fay of the Love and Logic Institute. Parents, is it really possible to raise well-behaved kids who are happy at the same time? And the answer is absolutely, as long as we can maintain balance. See, many of us fall into the trap of providing a lot of good discipline and solid limits without the love. And others of us fall into the trap of providing lots of love, but not very many limits, not much discipline. There has to be a balance. That's what love and logic is all about. Being powerful in the kids' eyes and, and doing it in a very warm and loving way. And for example, we know that kids need limits. And a simple trick of setting effective ones involves describing what you're going to do rather than trying to tell the kid what to do. So I might say to my young child, feel free to keep the toys that you pick up. And if they don't pick up their toys, I might have to keep them myself, at least for a period of time. Or with my teenager, I might, instead of saying, uh, you have to drive safely and giving a big lecture, I might try something like, well, you're more than welcome to drive the car as long as you've made a deposit equal to the insurance deductible into my account. See, don't make driving free, by the way. Teenagers do not fear death, but, but they do fear financial loss. So that's the, the limits part of it. Now, the other end of this has to do with how do we do this without losing their love? And, and that comes down to empathy. Remember that word? When you hear love and logic, you think empathy. See, when the kid, uh, oh, I've had to pick up their toys and now they're asking, where are my toys? I gotta show them my love. Oh, buddy, I love you. Oh, did you pick those up? Well, I don't know. Oh, buddy, and remember the toys that you pick up, you get to keep. Well, when do I get it back? Well, if you'd like some ideas about how you can earn those back, I'd be more than happy to help you. And do you see that I'm being loving while at the same time providing discipline so that I can have a child who grows to be happy and responsible at the same time? Or, or maybe my teenager has bumped up the car and uh, I can come to them when I'm calmed down and say, oh, I love you so much and I was so worried about you, but thank goodness you're okay. The only problem is uh, how are you gonna pay for the damage? And again, that love and that discipline at the same time. You know, when I really think about it, Way more important than getting our kids to behave is really teaching them how to get themselves to behave. And that's the heart of love and logic. Creating kids who have a little voice inside of their head that's constantly asking, how is this next decision I'm about to make going to work out? Well, we wish you great success with your parenting. And remember, you don't have to be a perfect parent to raise great kids. You just need the right amount of love and logic.